All right, Matthew, thank you very much. Tonight marks the second story in our segment, the new season, Hurricane Ready. When storms and hurricanes hit, you can find these hidden heroes really high in the sky, working to restore power and normalcy to our lives. Tonight, we get an inside look at how our local linemen are preparing for hurricane season 2020. For those without power, it's a sight for sore eyes. Because when the power goes out, these men go up. Wiregrass Electric Cooperative maintains around 24,000 meters and serves around 17,000 members. As hurricane season approaches, those on the front lines start to prepare. Just get everything staged out. You know, if the hurricane, if it's going to hit in Geneva County, we'll try to get some material and everything staged up there, or Houston County. Uh, we try to try to be ready and watch to see where it's going to hit and, and have our stuff lined up and ready. For crew members, hurricane season marks one of the busiest times of the year. We're on call 24-7. We're always there. There's never, never a day or a time that, that we don't work when the power goes out. It don't matter. If the power goes out, we're going to come get it on. On the management front, communication remains a top priority. We call it our emergency response plan, uh, ERP, and essentially it, it talks about all aspects of our business. Communication with employees, members, and customers. This keeps residents informed on where crews are and what they're doing. We want to be straightforward and forth, forthright always. If we think it's going to be seven days before your area is going to be restored after a major storm. We're going to tell you that. While being without power can be extremely frustrating, Wiregrass Electric crew members say it's important to remember crews are working even when you can't see them. They don't see us at night. They don't get the phone calls that we get at, at 1 o'clock or 3 o'clock in the morning. Despite this, linemen say their customers' reactions are part of what makes this grueling job worth it. You know, you see people going a couple of days without power. There's When you get their power on, there's always a smile on that face. You know, it can be aggravating and challenging at times, but it's also rewarding.